Welcome everybody to the pre-show. Getting ready to start the uh, broadcast here. I'm here in uh, going from Akihabara to um, Asakusa. Welcome guys. Another Voice of Nick show. We're going to be doing a little bit of shorter, stripped down broadcast this time. It's going to be, um, uh, I was here in Akihabara to do a little bit of shopping in the morning uh, for a change because usually I would go here like more in the afternoon time. Uh, so I'm back in Akihabara and now I'm going to Asakusa. So uh, we're gonna walk over to the train station. It's a nice crisp morning. I got myself this uh, piece of outerwear because I didn't really bring, I brought one sweatshirt with me. It's just kind of like, you know, my go-to one thing to have just in case I needed something utilitarian. But I figured like, oh, you know, I'll buy some more clothes when I'm there, you know, instead of bringing all my clothes. Kind of like do as the Romans do type thing. So yeah, I got a couple clothing items. Yesterday in Shibuya wasn't so successful of a clothing shopping day. I'm not really into that type of secondhand clothing purchase where it's like you know you're gonna buy like a t-shirt that costs $150 or something because it's like a like a rare find that they like cultivated for you or whatever I'm more interested in like you know finding rare finds that are more rare because the person selling it doesn't know how good it is you know where it's like you see the value in it more like thrift store kind of stuff which there's plenty of here so we'll, we'll look around for that kind of thing see that's it Thank you to uh, Newt McFly for the uh, follow earlier, I guess yesterday night. Much appreciated. So, we want to go basically just straight forward. I can't drink that much Pepsi, but I would kind of like like to drink a Pepsi. I don't know if this is the regular Pepsi or they have like a Pepsi energy drink that they made. This is in kind of the energy drink area. Ooh, an iced coffee. I'm gonna try that. It's always a race against the clock with these vending machines to try and get your thing before the uh, light changes.
nice being out in the morning like this, you know, like kind of before the city wakes up. Let's take a sip of our new uh, iced coffee here. I also bought some like masks at the 7-Eleven while I was here that are sort of like more Japanese focused where they have that kind of sharp curve and like up, upward pointed top part that you don't really see in the US. Um, so I got a Japanese haircut, bought some Japanese clothes, bought a Japanese mask. I'm sort of like <laughs> really getting into it here. Mm. The iced coffee is good. It's a blend um, or a uh, whatever with uh, milk. Oh yeah, cream Heidi. Says it's a limited time thing. So we're drinking rarefied air here. Had a great night yesterday, post stream. Went to Shibuya bars, and then uh, I went to uh, Maid Cafe with a person that I met at the bar. We were just like, you know, oh, you've never been to a Maid Cafe? Like, let's go. Uh, so that was really cool. And getting to see somebody else experience it for the first time was cool. And then um, went to uh, Golden Guy again which is always a great time. It's a good trip so far. So we, oh, my thing went away now. So it should be Looks like it's eight further minutes from here. And I think it's one stop to Asakusa from Akihabara. No, two stops. Very fast though, it seems like it would be like a three minute train ride. If it's two stops and it's not at a peak hour, maybe we'll even stream the train. I feel very uncomfortable with streaming on a subway train in Japan because privacy is kind of like a big thing here like you don't really want to invade people's privacy even more than obviously it's true anywhere but here there's like particular things about being on the train like don't talk on the phone don't talk to people in general you know don't drink or eat so I don't really want to but if there's nobody on it then it's one that's another matter yeah when I first uh, rented a streaming backpack in Japan I um, was filming like a pretty long train subway ride that uh, we were taking at the time and somebody like sat down in the seat across from me and I didn't even realize you know like oh this is kind of like like when I watched the stream back later I was like yeah, that was kind of weird of me to like film a POV shot of like somebody else sitting in a seat you know, so I, I try to avoid that kind of stuff. You know, live and learn, you learn from mistakes. Try to do better next time. I hope I didn't make that person feel too uncomfortable. Oh, it smells really good over here. So this is called Asakusabashi Station, but this is not where we're going. I think there's like a specific Asakusa line I think we could connect on this line, but we don't want to use it for what we're doing. Yeah, it's a little further.
I love the sort of architectural thing of the, the way that this subway uh, or whatever upper train thing is curving up and out sort of like in like a ribbed design so it yeah, it just gives like a really cool look I don't know as anyone knows who's been watching my Instagram stories I get fascinated by the weirdest little insignificant things but you know everybody's got their passions or whatever and that, that's mine I guess very small architectural elements. Damn, yeah, my phone keeps um, crashing the Twitch app, unfortunately, so I uh, can't really see comments in general because it keeps resetting. Every time it crashes the Twitch app, it resets the chat on my side. So just a heads up to anybody who has chatted or will plan to chat. It's a decent chance that I won't see your comment, but do know that you're appreciated. I know in spirit that you're here <laughs> and I appreciate you watching the show. This has been a very full featured trip so far. I got a couple of really cool museum recommendations too for from uh, somebody that I met yesterday. So I'm excited to go check that out. As we all know, museums are certainly an interest of mine. Okay, let's go in. We'll see sort of how well this works. garbage can in Japan, so whatever you see one, you gotta take advantage of it. Damn, me throwing away that can actually made me miss the train. That's alright. Yeah, it looks like it's not too crowded. So that's good. Damn, I can't get a picture of that sign. It's too bright. Let's see if I can... Oh, you know what? I forgot to check what the uh, frame rate looked like. Let's see if I can watch back the old episode. Atakajini-san, hello everyone. I'm going to go to Asakusa. But I'm going to be watching it. But I'm going to be watching it. 
<laughs> it does look like the frame rate's a little bit weird. I can't really tell. I'll have to check it when I get back to the room. I didn't get a chance to check yesterday. Ima Tokyo ni nan desu ka? Ah, hai hai hai. Eto, ima Akihabara ni imasu. Eh, imashita. Soshite, eto, kono hi kara eh Asakusa ni imasu. はい、もう、もう1回の東京旅行に行きました。1ヶ月前、えっと、2週間の旅行にしました。そして今2週間の旅行、2週間以上の旅行います。That's a really scary prospect. It's basically saying that the, the gap between the platform and train at this station is particularly large. So uh, be careful where you step. But yeah, the idea of like getting stuck between that is like really scary to me. <laughs>
we going? So, we're currently going to uh, Asakusa. And I don't know how long I'm really gonna stream again at Asakusa. Because uh, I'm like, I have something planned, so I might sort of cut the show off once we get there, but we'll see. Whoa, that is a big gap. How are you doing, Cross, today? I don't know how to really plan, like, you know, oh, I'm going to leave from the whatever A3 exit because that gets me closest. I just want to get out of the station as fast as I can. <laughs> so I just look for the closest exit. And sometimes it's like you turn a hallway because you're like, oh, you know, I can get out right here. And it turns out that it's a huge, you know, distance to get to the, uh, the door. さあ、いいですね。行ったことない。これはもっとちょっと暮らしくな感じですか。どんな感じ。どんな雰囲気。この、この街。へえ。そのビル。何だったですか。<笑> 金色の人間、人参のビルですか。浅草。浅草。Crossing got done. A lot done since you're off on weekends. Well, that's good to hear. Good to see you, Frost. And good morning, good Tokyo morning to you. Good uh, evening. <laughs> good East Coast evening to you as well. Wow, what a cool looking boat. Look at that boat. Very futuristic. I gotta get a closer look at that. Let's go across the bridge. When this thing comes by, look at that thing. That's like a Sid Mead concept design. <laughs> I gotta hurry up here and get closer to this boat. <laughs> Holy crap. I'm gonna use that in my concept design for the uh, sci-fi cruise ship I was doing. Remember that? You see that thing? Love that. I wish I could get closer. What is it? I made out of it looks like a, oh my God, and it's got little little portholes. Ah, damn it. I wish I could have gotten a picture of that. I'm sure I got it in the other picture. That was like <laughs> concept uh, heaven right there. That was really cool. So that was like a, uh, like a ferry, I guess, because it had all passenger seats and portholes and stuff. And I guess that's like a, you know, sort of 180 degree sunroof type situation. Good design. Oh, that is on a totally traditional, this ne. Sensoji temple, yes, yo. 
戦争時戦争えっと戦争からそれともそれが多分違うの言葉ですか<笑>戦争時戦争の時ですかえっと今は何時ですかああ多分ね戦争時です<笑>プロセガイ、エンディアファンがスリープラスナイトのストリーム。おお、グッド。おお、グッド。おお、グッド。Uh, facilitate that. A sin soji. So, a saxa samurai. So, no, me, uh, me, no, uh, Sanba, no, Charaka, what, uh, none of this stuff. So, no, Crossing, I woke up with the phone in my hand and your stream's still up even though it ended. <laughs> wow. That's like a very、uh, good way to start the day, huh? A little bit of voice in Nick. It's better than coffee. Well, let's not get ahead of ourselves. It's rivaling coffee. あテンプルですかあー分かった分かったえど,どうやってえっ、ー、と発音ですかテンプルはえっ、ー、とみ,みやないテンプルはちょっと知らないあ。
port town where there are many inns for sailors and ferries. Sen Soji. So this is where you're talking about then. テラ。ああ、はいはいはい。今覚えてる。ありがとうございます。近くにブルーボトルコーヒーあった気がします。ブルーボトルコーヒー。え、行きたい。Crossing <笑> I don't drink coffee so you're the next best thing. There you go. Appreciate it. You go inside of there. Yeah, you can see there is a particularly troublesome Japanese character there, uh, which very uncomfortable to look at. But it is, uh, I guess, it's the opposite direction, and obviously that was co-opted by, you know, later things for a different purpose. But it originally was a, it had its own meaning. Outside of what it kind of like now symbolizes, um, it's one of those things though where you would think that like they would kind of just like take that one out of the canon and be like, all right, let's come up with a new character now because <laughs> we can't really use that one anymore. A Google map. Eh, I want to go look at that anchor over there. あ、それ近いです。この駅から。ありがとう。Let's go look at this thing. about the bridge. Oh cool, there's like a illustration. I don't know if you can see that. It's like cut into the into the uh copper. Komakata. It's like a type of pigeon, I guess. Like a hato, but it's dobato. Esa to wa nan desu ka? Esa. Ah, wakata, wakata. Ii tokoro desu yo. Agenmanju ga oishii desu. Eh... 
So the thing about don't give the pigeons food because they're gonna cause problems. Probably a good advice. Okay, so let's go up this way. Go to that 7 Eleven over there. The nice thing is that you can charge your Suica card at 7 Eleven, which is like your subway card. Um, but it's kind of annoying because for some reason Suica doesn't take Visa cards, is what I read online. Because I'd put my card, credit card into the machine to charge it. And it was like, oh, there's a problem. Like, can't use that. And obviously, you know, like, I can still use the card. So it's not being, like, declined. And I called the company, and it's not, it's not some kind of, like, you know, you're out of the country. Like, is this you fraud thing? So uh, it's literally just that they don't take Visa, I guess. Which is, like, kind of surprising. Because I would expect that that's, like, the most commonly used one, but yeah, you just have to use cash. It's a very cash-centric uh, city, uh, Japan, or you know, country. Which is not necessarily true in, in the U.S. Mossberger branded toys is pretty good. Oh, that's pretty cool. Damn, it's 400 yen though. See, these are cool. It's like the buttons that you find on a vending machine. <laughs> This one's uh, and it's saying like uh, sold out or like how much money or currently uh, you know selling or stuff is available. 
So this is like what I would say when it's cold, a cold drink or a hot drink. Let's get that one. I wonder if they take 500 yen. Probably not. I don't know if I have 400 yen coins. Oh yeah, I guess I do. Looks like we got, let's open it. I want to keep the box though. Usually you just throw the box out immediately, but it's easy to transport them like this, you know, back to the US. We got the sold out, <laughs> good stuff. Oh, and it's a hot drink, sold out hot drink. That's kind of what I was hoping for. I think it's funnier that it would be a sold out sign than just like a regular price tag. Um, so let me take off the backpack for a second. I'm gonna put this in my backpack, so hang tight. I'm gonna unplug the uh, cable, uh, the microphone cable. Welcome, Kane Gunzi. Welcome. Welcome, Plot King, as well, to the show. We're in uh, Asakusa in Tokyo. I love these signs. So the thing is testing your temperature, I guess. Although it's not working, it's a temperature tester. <laughs> I don't know how it tests it, though. Is it t checking the... your? F it's not checking your forehead, because I wasn't standing in front of it. I think it checks your hand, like how hot your hand is. I like these little plates. This would be good to bring home. A little commemorative uh, plate. So you can buy manga at the convenience store. Like this is Tokyo Revengers. Another instance of not uh, like the fact that that's on the front cover of their thing. I know that it goes in the other direction, but it's still like, <laughs> come on, maybe you don't like put it front and center. But yeah, that's just a Japanese character. One of the many Japanese uh, letters. Get a big old beer. Not, uh, not the time for it. like a gogurt package which I really like they have like drink drinking yogurt um, in like bottles and when I went to that place last trip a month ago to that uh, really spicy ramen place that's like when I say really spicy I mean as a person who's eaten the spiciest foods in the world it is the spiciest thing I've ever had uh, that place I went there and my stomach was really upset and uh, I got that drinkable yogurt and it really helped. Tokyo Revengers, Kino Yomimashita, so this car. 
<笑>いいですね僕はその漫画えっ、ー、と一巻だけ、えー、読みました楽しかったえっ、ー、とけどそんなえっ、ー、とえっ、ー、とタイムトラベルと SF といろんな<笑>いろんな、えー、話ポイントがあるね<笑>ちょっと,、えー、と理解難しかったけど、えー、と次の<笑>次のボ,ボリューム読みたいです<笑> For us, I really want to see the Temples and stuff there, if I ever visit it. And of course, the cherry blossoms. Yeah, well, that's definitely a big part of going to Japan for a lot of people.、Uh, I've never done that even now. I've gone to a temple that's like in Tokyo, which is a pretty big one, but I've never gone like out into the country or like looked at the trees or whatever. I always go during the winter or during the fall. Every trip. I've been here five times now. Every single trip has been during the fall.、Um, so I haven't been able to ever see the trees or anything. But yeah, personally, to me, it's more about the. My interest lies, I guess, more in the,、uh, the sprawl of Tokyo. You know, the, the urban sprawl. See how t h a t さんはな,<笑>なぜ、えー、と笑っていますか Guys, that's gonna do it for this one. I'm gonna call it here.、Uh, I'm gonna go explore this part of town. But、uh, I will see you guys on another one. We got plenty more stuff. I'm here for another 12 days or something, so keep your eyes out for more、uh, episodes. Oh man, it has been a good trip so far, and it's only just begun. So, yeah. Stay tuned. The channel is called The Voice of Nick. I stream three times a day, seven days a week on here, so a lot of stuff. If you want to see more, don't forget to follow. And、uh, currently I'm in Tokyo, Japan, so that's a whole exciting aspect in itself for me.、I'm、really happy to be back so soon. <laughs> so, plenty of stuff coming up. Keep your eyes peeled. I'll see you next time. The post show, ladies and gents. Thank you for watching the show. I will see you、uh, next episode. Bye bye.